What's up everyone, my name is Jesse, this is the Audits Forum, I react to video game music as a musician myself. Today's a debut on the channel, Dicey Dungeons, and the song is called Fortune Favors the Bold, requested by Mushimiri on Patreon. Don't know anything about this whatsoever, never even heard of the name. And it says the original soundtrack by Chipzol, which this is their channel, uploaded four years ago. Okay, well... Don't know anything, so I might as well just press play and see what happens. Fortune favors the bold. <laughs> okay. Fretless bass? This is wild. It's not even close to being over yet. This is like what music lovers love, just music all together at once. It's like such an art form to do stuff like this. Damn, dude. This is amazing. Cheers. Oh, what the hell? We're getting ape it now? Oh, 
I love those crouchers. Giving it such an atmosphere of like outside. Touching grass. We're still adding new stuff. I have no idea how this song is going to end. Just a little minute left. Like, I'm trying to find out where it's going to go, but I have no idea. Fading out. I don't even know if it looped. That was just constant progression. Damn, dude. Damn. It's been a while since something has like really caught my attention like that. This is like. To me, kind of the definition of, of video game music, which is a broad term. You know, nothing really falls. It's such an umbrella term. It, it, it just means games or music from games, right? But when I say like video game music, I feel like this, this is like the only place you'd really hear this kind of stuff. You don't hear it in movies. You don't hear it in TV. You don't hear it on the radio. It pretty much stuff like this solely exists in video games. Or like in someone's obscure SoundCloud of their like Fruity Loop demos or something, you know. So it's kind of hard to find. If you're into this kind of stuff, you're not going to give a whole bunch of artists who can... It's like a very... It's like a niche within a niche within a niche. But it's... Uh, it scratches a specific itch of like progressive music, video game music, real instruments right those were horns and I, I lost count of how many things were in that song there were so many things in that song and so many layers and so many directions that it went uh, at first i thought it was going to be kind of more bass focused because it had a lot i believe it sounded like a fretless bass and then times it sounded like a stand-up bass and then that kind of just disappeared and started pulsating and more synths came in and it just it was a ride, just put it lightly. Uh, extremely talented. That's like the main thing I really took away is the, the sheer talent of this from uh, Chipzel. They know what they're doing. And it's, it's kind of scary <laughs> because that's one song. That's one song. And before I clicked this video, I checked how many other requests I have for it. I always get curious. And there's a couple, there's a couple not many. There's like three or four. So... It's made somewhat of an impression, and but I've I've never I've never heard of it at all. Dicey Dungeons, Fortune favors the boss. That's such a cool name too. I know I noticed the spelling of favors is more the like the EU version. Here in America, we don't use the the U. Um, not that that matters, but I just noticed that. <sighs> so many sounds. You know, I was trying to put my, my finger on it. I'm like, what is it about this song that I really enjoy? Why am, why am I so ecstatic about it? You know, I, I pretty much knew early on that I was really going to like it. And I was trying to think at the same time, trying to jam out and trying to not think so much, just enjoying it. 
And I think, I think what I naturally want to say is like my reaction from it is I don't think it sounds like anything. I can't really think of anything that sounds like that game wise. I feel like there's maybe one or two, like I can think of maybe Undertale, but not really. Undertale has similar like sounds, like some beeps and some, but it's not really, it doesn't sound like Undertale. There's uh there's a hat in time which kind of comes close with the experimentation but it doesn't really get I mean I don't know like to me this just sounded very unique which is such an odd word you know in the year 2023 it's like everything's been done there's only 12 notes in the musical alphabet you know <laughs> like there's only so many frets on a guitar so many keys on a keyboard everything's been done but then you every now and then you hear something and it'll just like kind of really rattle you and push the extremes how how much more juice we can get out of this like music lemon that we have um yeah so it was like undertale ish hat in time splatoon kind of uh just, this is another one too i can't think of either way it was just very unique and for that i mean to stand out in a sea of hundreds that I've heard. Almost a thousand now. <laughs> it's crazy. That's a pretty big deal. And the fact that it came out of nowhere, I never heard of Dicey Dungeons, I never heard of Chip Soul. It's always fun, because it's always this is what I'm this is like my like one of my favorite things of this channel is the ones we don't hear about, the 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 underdogs or something. I mean this could be a popular game for all I know. But I'm I'm talking when I say those things I mean relating to me, like things I've just never heard of at all. Sometimes there's games I've heard their name, or I've seen something, you know, something, and then I get curious. This I just I was just like, oh, okay, well, I'm doing a Dicey Dungeon song today, cool, and then all of a sudden, now it turns into me recommending it to people, and when people ask me what I do or something, I'd be like, well, I check out video game music, but also check this out, <laughs> you know, and they'll understand. So it's a little more than just like a cool song. That was dope. That was dope. And I noticed something with this requester is that uh, plenty of their songs feature horn sections and saxophones and trumpets and uh, good grooves and that's all stuff I really love. So <laughs> thank you, Mushi. Okay, cool. Let me know more about Chipsel, uh, Dicey Dungeons, whatever. Uh, fantastic. As far as setting, don't ask me. I have no idea. No idea. I have no idea what that title refers to. Didn't get any sort of vision setting, nothing. I was just jamming out. So <laughs> let me know what you think of this game and what that was. Damn. <laughs> what a shakeup. Thank you to everyone that you see here. Thanks to you for watching. My name is Jesse in the auditorium. Long live video game music. Take it easy.